The Chinese government is releasing previously unseen videos documenting the suffering of women forced into sex slavery by the Japanese military during World War II. And they include not only horrific descriptions of human rights violations against the women, but also some unspeakable atrocities. Sun Jung-in has more. Since Saturday, China's State Archives Administration has been releasing a video series each day about Japan's abuse of women during World War II. The first video released on August 15th, exactly 70 years after Japan surrendered in 1945, includes descriptions of the horrors the so-called comfort women went through and where they were imprisoned. It's then followed by testimony from a Japanese soldier named Tsuyoshi Ebato, who recalls how a Chinese woman was killed and eaten by Japanese soldiers during the invasion of the Sandong Peninsula. The soldier recalls how a Japanese surgeon killed a woman who was forced to become a sex slave. And since food was scarce at the time, he ate her flesh and shared it with his squadron after telling them it was regular meat. The second in the series, released on Sunday, reveals how Japanese intelligence personnel reported to their higher-ups on the operation of brothels in Chinese cities. The document includes evidence that 141 women were forced to serve some 25,000 Japanese troops stationed in Nanjing. The Chinese Archives Administration says it's an undeniable historical fact the Japanese military systematically kidnapped women and operated brothels in their military bases. However, Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe's statement last Friday to mark the 70th anniversary of the end of World War II made no direct reference to the issue. The administration says it's releasing confessions of Japan's wartime atrocities for eight days in the hope such evil acts are never repeated. Son Jung-in, Arirang News.